YouTube, this your boy Ross Reptiles, and I told y'all it was coming. I told y'all it was coming. Chomp, chomp. Look, check it out. So I told y'all we were going to be coming up with different concoctions of uh, different types of meals and mixing stuff together for the reptiles to eat. And, um, you know, I have no idea what I'm going to create today for the Tagu, uh, the Asian Water Monitor, really mainly uh, them two, and possibly the Black Thought if he could fit some small bits and pieces in his mouth, but mainly them two. Um, yeah, so I've got some special food items on the menu. Obviously, the Water Monitor won't be having veggies involved, so that's for the Tagu. So I have my collars here, I got my, uh, my chicken thighs here, and I have tilapia, and I have shrimp in here which I will be separating. Also, I do have eggs um, that I had them uh, boiling for a minute so they could just be a little bit of, uh, a little bit soft. They are done now, so I gotta kinda hurry this up so they won't be a little too hard. And uh, I might squeeze in a little banana too uh, for rain. You know what I'm saying, cut it up. You know what, can you pass me a banana please? That's one, one to do. All right, thank you. So yeah, whoop, now we got the banana on the menu. So. Yeah, with that being said, I'm gonna get started. First thing first, I'm gonna rinse my collars off because I didn't rinse them at all. Can you rinse those for me, please? All right. So, uh, yeah, guys, I'm pretty excited to see what I come up with and see how the animals actually react to the to the dishes I make. And uh, yeah, I think the first thing first we're gonna start off with is the chicken thighs because one thing about chicken thighs, you know, they come with the skin and all that on them. So, not sure if you guys can really see it, so we gotta come up close come with the skin and all that you know so i want to take the, the skin off because it's going to make the meat leaner now um in my household we like to cook a lot so we always watching food network and things like that so i'll be seeing what they be doing sometimes so i'm going to make sure it's right so we got my collars right here so y'all can see mm -mm -mm. Mm -hmm. looking amazing guys so all right so first thing first we're going to tear the skin off these boys um, let me bring my trash can a little closer to me because I'm gonna just be dumping this stuff along the way. And uh, yeah, we'll go from there. All right, so chicken, take the skin off. Don't be scared of it, you know what I'm saying? Peel it back, you know? And the parts that you have trouble with, you know, you can either leave it on now or you can take a little knife, slice and dice, you know, and uh, go from there. And why, why is this important that I'm doing this type of stuff? Um, it's because, you know, we want we want to make sure our animals are getting uh, a variety of different foods. And uh, when we make sure that they're getting a variety of different meals, we ensure that their health is spectacular. So, you know, with that being said, like I said, guys, I ain't no, I ain't no professional cutter or nothing like that. But, hey, I'm making it do what it do. So you people who are chefs, hey, don't judge me. Um, you know, obviously, let's see. I will be keeping the uh, do actual bone in these because it won't hurt them. They'll be all right. Some of the animals in which they eat have bone in them too. And they digest them with no problem. And then every single different dish I create or meat I deal with, poultry or whatever you guys want to say, uh, fish, I will be, uh, I will be cleaning my, um, my cupboard every single time I use it. I, yeah, I'm not feeding a human, but hey, I treat my animals like they are humans. So, all right, gotta do that one. This should be going here. Yep. But yeah, guys, you know, hope you guys enjoying this uh, this type of video. I'm not sure how many people are gonna tune in to it because it is a bit different. But I feel like we could start doing episodes with this type of stuff because it's a unique, um, it's a unique way of doing things. You know, switch it up, have fun with it. I don't see many people uh, do this at all. Like you know, there are people, there are a lot of people actually who feed their uh, their reptiles. You know, chicken breasts, um, all types of different stuff. I didn't have any ground turkey on the menu today. That's what I did one, but I didn't have enough time to go to the store, so I just. Uh, use what I had in office. And uh, we gonna make it do what it do. And this type of food items that I am using, they will make sure uh, these animals are nice and full. 
I really don't like, you know, I don't really like all this stuff on my chicken too, so I'll be taking the fat off. <clears throat> you keep the fat on if you want, you know, uh, the skin, but uh, it's not really necessary if you don't want to. So, that being said, chicken almost ready. Hopefully everybody having a great day, an amazing day. You know, if you're not having a great day, I hope this video cheer you up because we will be feeding the animals um, on this video and uh, see how they like the, the stuff I've made up. And uh, yeah, all right, so give me one second and we rinse this off and then I'll be right back. All right, welcome back guys. So now that that's done with, actually, Sorry, gotta do this too. Now we will move on to the tilapia, which is, in my opinion, the easiest part to really make. So I only have uh, one big piece of filet here, which is good enough for me. I have a great knife, so cuts them up perfectly. Um, don't need to do it too hard. But yeah, guys, I, I love these animals so much. So, you know, giving them a break from um, food sources that they eat all the time, like rats, uh, you know, it's, it's always a pleasure because every week, even outside of the videos, I try to make sure that I give them um, different stuff that you guys don't see. So that's pretty incredible. And, you know, we had cut some up smaller. You want to make sure that this is uh, plentiful looking, at least. <clears throat> but yeah, guys. Man, I, I love this stuff, man. I love uh, taking care of my animals on a daily basis, making sure that they get these nice, nutritious meals. And, uh, you know, I couldn't ask for more. So hopefully you guys uh, have fun with this type of video. And, um, you know, maybe you guys could do this for your own animals. Even your bearded dragon likes collard greens, uh, you know, occasionally fruit. Um, kale, like, you know, like for the, for the bearded dragon species, you always want to make sure that, um, you know, you actually incorporate a lot of the veggies because they make up a lot of their diet, which uh, a lot of people don't realize. So, all right. So, we got the kale right here. We got the chicken over here, chicken quarters. No, we might, you know, I might show y'all garlic. I don't know yet. Got my little shrimp. I think I should cut up the shrimp to mix it up. You just might. Let's see. I'm being a little extra doing that, but. Make sure my shrimp is all good. Show y'all what the shrimp look like. Incredible. Let's see, do we do we cut up the shrimp or should we leave it? I don't know. But first thing first, um, I do think I'm gonna need another bowl because Spidey Spidey won't eat stuff like this. He probably would if I gave it to him. It wouldn't hurt him if he ate it or not. But um yeah, let me rinse this stuff off one more time. All right, so we're back. So I got my eggs that I just got out this, uh, you know, this pot. Looking incredible. As usual, gonna cut out the banana. Gonna make this as fast as we can. And uh, we're gonna go from there. I feel like a professional. You see how fast I'm cutting this up? Yeah, guys. All right, incredible. So now I got all my I cut up um, bananas. Yeah, I like the way I cut those quick like that. We're gonna have to do a replay probably. But well, yeah, we got the bananas cut. Incredible. All right, we're gonna shave the bananas. Actually, we're gonna shave the kale in first. I'm gonna shave the pieces of kale. 
Got to sprinkle it like they do on TV. Uh, uh, uh. Chomp, chomp. Incredible. So like, got a little bit of that. Boom. All right. So you're going to put Rain loves his banana. Couple pieces of that in there. Mm -hmm. A little bit of egg. Just crack it just a tad for them. I like to do that, especially if they get a little hard and make it easy for them to eat. So now, a little bit of that. It's gonna look a little weird, guys, but I think it's gonna work out. I'm mixing everything. It ain't gonna hurt them. So we're gonna take a little bit of shrimp. Take a couple pieces of, uh, of uh, tilapia. And we're going to give him one nice piece of uh, chicken thigh. So, you know, I mean, it's going to be all right. I think it's nutritious. It's look weird, but it's nutritious. So, we got uh, banana. Chicken thigh, egg, and shrimp. All in one. For my boy Rain. Now, Rain don't eat as much as Spotty yet, so we don't know if he's gonna eat all of them. But what we do know is Spotty will. So, I don't think I ever gave, if I'm not mistaken, I never gave uh, Spotty actually chicken thigh before. I gave him um, a drumstick before though. So, Spotty, shrimp, tilapia, they go together. All right, eggs, we don't, you know, I'm gonna put some in just to give it flavor. A little carnivore, throw a couple of these in there. Something to fatten them up. Then we got our eggs on here for him. And then, for the remainder, I can get these to my bearded dragon. Oh yeah, we gotta throw the rest of these bananas in here. So, all right. So for now, and the rest of this might go to Gara. Gara, he eat these old flying colors. But as you guys can see, eggs, chicken, shrimp, tilapia. Look good. Poor reptile. <laughs> Hopefully I uh, did a good job with this and then for rain, you know, we got a smooth concoction. Incredible. With the egg in there. So, hope y'all like episode one. I know it's pretty much basic, but if I had ground turkey, um, I would have did something spectacular because you can roll stuff up and put it together. So, the next video, stay tuned. I think we're going to incorporate ground turkey, make some veggie balls with uh, turkey veggie balls for... Um, the, uh, the, the red tegu. Uh, we're going to incorporate the ground turkey and egg and stuff like that. We're going to do some crazy stuff. Crazy stuff. So let's see how this goes. And then, as well as, after I feed these guys over the next couple of days, by the next episode of this specific type of video, what I will do, I will update you guys to see how their bodies actually reacted to it, how their bowel movements were. Um, and yeah, we'll see how it goes. So, Let's go to the reptile room, guys. Crap! Spidey. Come here, big boy. Yeah. Come here, boy. Come here. Come on. Come on. Come on. He's coming. He's trying to figure out a way to get over here. Check this out, guys. Come on. <laughs> Take your time. Come on. Yeah. Good boy. Woo! Almost got my hand now. Incredible. Mm hmm? Like that one. Check this out. 
down the hatch. Good job. You don't want that to go in the water. Wonder would you go get it? Uh, I think that one's going, guys. Let's see what he does. Woo! Let's see what he does. Can you grab it? No, you can't grab it, can you? I'll get it for you. No worries. You got more. You got more, boy. All right, here you go. Nice. Incredible. <laughs> there you go. It's breaking now. It's a little hard at night, guys. I bet it a bit too long. Just looking at them, guys. Go ahead. Look at that. See. Breaking this one all over the place. Yeah. Uh oh. One more time. I'm cracking that boy up. Nice. Ah, 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 ah. There you go. Get it back. Nope. <laughs> Don't jump in there. Mm -hmm. Well, of course, the person. You like that. She was like, yo, man. Delicious. He loves it, guys. I do not have my tones right now, so. Hey. Gotta feed him with the bowl. <laughs> this guy is looking amazing. Dude, he's like a champ. Ain't that right, big boy? Don't try nothing crazy. <laughs> Cause he will try to run out of here and get to my car. All right, boy. Did you forget? We still have. All right, tilapia. Nice. Um, sit. No, just. <laughs> there you go. One more. Go get it. You looking the wrong way. I really forgot I could have used my tongs when he could have made it easier. Engagement wise. But yeah guys, he's looking good. You can even see right here on his body, the old shed right there. It's uh like it's coming off pretty good, so. Mm -hmm. Never disturb a reptile when they're eating. He loves it, guys. Look like we got some more chicken breasts, well, chicken thighs, so he just might take it. Trust me, guys. Yes, if he did grab my hand, it will hurt. Hospital visit for sure. No exaggeration about that. But he does know the difference between me and the food. So, but him being thirsty, he definitely could uh, end up biting me on accident. Because he's done it before. <laughs> I just can't believe you guys. Like people who've been with the channel in a while, you guys seen how um, he used to escape and he would just 
he was destroying his skin and things like that. And it's just good to see. I have no more. I gave you everything. There's no more in here. See? No more. No more. There you go, right there. Mm -hmm. Chomp, chomp. Incredible. Now, I just gotta get in here and get this, uh, get this egg. Let's see, I believe I have a net somewhere. One second, guys. Look at him, he's in there. Let's start. He just tasting the juices. The egg was in the water. All right, last one. Looks like that's gonna fall. Boom. Now you gotta go get it. That's why I like how I open this whole enclosure up. And you can literally see everything. I'm gonna get better with the eggs, guys. I'm still working on it. So cracking. Incredible reptile. Chomp, chomp. So you're gonna have nowhere to go. You're gonna have to break it. There you go. Nice. That boy pretty much broke. Mm hmm. Looks like you loved it, guys. You know, buddy. Nice. So let's go feed my boy Rain, the red tackle. We got rain food right here. We're going to take it up and uh, we're going to see how he likes his food as well. So let's see what you guys think. Incredible. All right, guys, let's see what rain is about. So uh, let me see. Actually, I might have a, uh, look for a little bowl. Well, I don't. So he going to be eating all this out of a little pot. <laughs> but let's see how he likes it. Let me see. 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 Let's test the camera real quick. Make sure y'all can see that. Okay, y'all can see it. And don't judge me, guys. I got a vacuum on the reptile floor. So, hey, let's get to it. Rain, what up, boy? Come on out. Come on. He's very quick, guys, so come on. Come on out. Come get him. See what he does, guys. Come on out, man. Behind the camera so you guys can see. Let's see what he does, guys. What you doing, man? I know you hungry. There ain't nothing you can tell me. With him, definitely could use a tongue too, yo. Watch this. Rain. Come here. Rain. 
Come on. Come on. Got all that food right in front of you. Okay, there we go. You stay. Yeah, he's shedding like a madman right now, so. Mm -hmm. Old nutritious meal right in front of him. Some banana, some nice collards. Some shrimp, some chicken thighs, some tilapia, all in one. Incredible animal. With some amazing sharp claws, you guys can see. That's my boy. Like I said, guys, these guys can eat anything. I want to see what he finishes and what he skips over. Notice he really loves bananas. So that's his main focus right now. Yes, sir. He looking in there like, what the, what is this stuff? All right, he going for the tilapia next. Nice. Incredible. Hope you guys try some of this at home, guys. Like, hey, my boys eat like a king. <laughs> Think they eat better than me. I want to see if he's going to get to the egg, too. Okay. <laughs> he spit that stuff out. He's like, what is this? Okay, on to the shrimp. He just tasting stuff. Mm hmm? It should be a pretty long video, so hopefully it got some of you guys entertained. The Rise Academy Food Edition. The Chef Edition. He's almost done shedding. Not the day, so I should be able to help him um, take the rest of it off. He literally tasting it. Like, what is this stuff? I'm trying to get that shed off. Okay, yeah, you got the one part off your face. Let me see if I can help you. <clears throat> Let me see. Yeah, this part ain't really a problem. Come here. Oh yeah, mind you guys. Rain is uh he's pretty shy. When I say shy, this dude is shy as ever. There you go. 
I finished eating, dude. Bottom shed was what was bothering him. Eat your own shed, man. All right, so let's get in here. Let's help you out. Yeah. He really don't like the uh, the collars, guys. He don't like the collars. I notice he's picking through it. <laughs> so next time, what we'll do for him, we we'll get the ground turkey and we'll ball it up with veggies and see what happens. Just an incredible animal. Incredible. You might like this. Can you handle that? I don't know if you can, but you could try. Thought your jaws was a bit bigger. Oh, you didn't got all that stuff on it, man. Shake it up now. You got a lot of work to do. I might have to just give him a new piece and cut it in half. All right, dude. Let me see. Get that some I can wipe all this off with. Chucks off. All right, Rain. Did the best I could do for you. I got most of it off. Come here, boy. Come here. Come here. He's done. Here. Come on. You got to come out and get it. Where are you going? I'm not trying to hurt you, dude. <laughs> he said, hey, I just got out there and closed it. I'm playing to my escape. Rain. Trust me, there's no way you can go. Rain, come here. Come. Okay, you don't want that. So, all right, egg time. Let's see. Rain, he's still young, guys, so. Come here. Come. Come. Here. <laughs> this lizard is hilarious. Okay, have it your way. Try to let you out. It don't look like you want to, um... Okay, I'm about to say. You better come back. Because you're going to lose your privileges. You have an egg right there. You want it? You 
good on the egg. It's gonna be more for Spidey. Here. I'm looking at the camera. He don't get that much time out like he used to. Well, not used to, but recently. He like the way that carpet feels helping him with the shed. But look like he don't want it anymore. So, um, guess we head back to my boy. He's getting it. He, he's liking the carpet because the carpet is helping him get that shed off. He probably feel like he has trouble in the enclosure doing so. So, I think you ate enough, huh? That's rain, guys. It's beautiful. Red table. You guys can see he's thinking about everything he's doing. Literally everything. This is the closest he's ever even been to me. Like so, this shows a lot. Check this out. He's right up on me. He's chilling, licking me, making sure I'm no threat. I think it's pretty cool. See what he does, guys. Giving him a chance. See? Look out. Giving him a chance. <laughs> it's funny saying the lizard just slide like he's a snake, right? I'm going to open up his other side of his enclosure to see if he wants to go in. I'm done with this nonsense. Incredible, guys. So, I have no idea how long this video is going to be for you all. Um, so, I'm definitely going to cut it short here. And, uh, yeah, comment, share, subscribe, YouTube. This your boy, Roz Reptiles. Hope y'all enjoyed this food special. And I'm out. He just wanted his time out, guys. That's all. <laughs>